Hey guys, how are you? Jeff with half Ass Gaming here. Um, I'm going to do a little how-to uh, today after a few different times of uh, doing some mesh editing. Um, I've had to remove nested verts, and a lot of times they can be a pain in the rear, we will say. So um, after you've mesh edited, uh, as you can see, I only have these uh, front nuts here. Um, they came off of a an old rim, so I had to mesh edit the entire tire and wheel and everything off of it. Um, and now I have them duplicated left and right. Um, so what you'll get when you go to export a lot of times is it'll say um, could not be exported hidden vertices or something of that nature. So And it will tell you the model. So what that means is um, some of the vertices are out. You disconnect them from something else and now they need to essentially have an edge and so you remove them with this button right here but it doesn't really do anything until you do a couple of steps first so let me show you what to do so you select your model and then you select your mesh now right so now it shows the mesh we're working with go to the mesh menu show hide show hidden okay then you press a that selects the mesh actually we'll skip that for a second so let's do that over again so select the model select the mesh show hidden then mesh, then faces, triangulate, then A, then remove. Let me go over to the next one. Select the mesh, mesh, show hide, show hidden, Faces, triangulate, A, remove. So now we should be good to export. So we'll try it out right now. These are teardrop nuts. F. get our left and right variants those are all good and then we will the window up we're going to export check our window successfully finished. So once you get to uh, creating SCS model objects, you'll see it start counting down and saying, okay, this one didn't have correct vertices, that one didn't have correct vertices, and that's when you need to go in and do this removing nested vertices. Um, I hope this helps you if you're doing any kind of mesh editing. Uh, it is a an excellent feature of uh, Blender, and it can help you remove a lot of different things uh, from a model that you don't want. Uh, let me know if uh, you're looking for something else. 
in Blender. I'm slowly adding to the uh, repertoire, so look for another video soon. Thanks as usual for uh, watching, guys. If you're enjoying the videos, let me know by liking. If you haven't subscribed, I would really appreciate it. Uh, pushing 600 subscribers now, so thank you so much for your support. We'll catch you next time.